Hello. Today, we delve into a topic that often sparks curiosity and debate, the age at which men and women should consider stopping sexual activity. It's important to note that discussions around sexual activity encompass a range of factors, including physical health, emotional well-being, and personal preferences. In this video, we'll explore various considerations and shed light on the subject of age and sexual intimacy. 1. Healthy Aging and Sexual Wellness As individuals age, it's natural for the body to undergo changes that can affect sexual function and desire. However, there is no universally fixed age at which individuals should stop having sex. Instead, it's crucial to focus on maintaining sexual wellness throughout life by adopting healthy lifestyle habits, seeking medical advice when needed, and fostering open communication with partners. 2. Physical Health and Sexual Activity Physical health plays a significant role in sexual well-being. Chronic health conditions such as cardiovascular disease, diabetes, or arthritis may impact sexual function. However, with appropriate medical management and support, many individuals can continue to engage in sexual activity well into their later years. Regular exercise, a balanced diet, and routine medical checkups can help maintain overall health and sexual vitality. 3. Emotional and Psychological Aspects Sexual intimacy is not solely about physical pleasure, but also encompasses emotional and psychological connections. As individuals age, emotional closeness, trust, and intimacy often become increasingly important. Building and nurturing these aspects can contribute to a satisfying sexual life, regardless of age. Open communication and understanding between partners are crucial in addressing any concerns or changes that may arise. 4. Personal Preferences and Consent Consent is a cornerstone of healthy sexual relationships at any age. Each individual has the right to make decisions about their own bodies and engage in sexual activity if they desire. Age should not be the sole determining factor in deciding when sexual activity should cease. Rather, it should be based on personal preferences, comfort levels, and mutual agreement between consenting adults. 5. Seeking professional guidance. If concerns or challenges arise related to sexual health or intimacy, seeking professional guidance can be beneficial. Healthcare providers such as doctors, therapists, or sexual health specialists can offer advice, address specific concerns, and provide appropriate treatment options tailored to individual needs. Conclusion In conclusion, there is no specific age at which men and women should definitively stop having sex. Sexual activity is a personal and individual choice that depends on various factors, including physical health, emotional well-being, and personal preferences. Maintaining open communication with partners, adopting healthy lifestyle habits, and seeking professional guidance when needed can contribute to a satisfying and fulfilling sexual life throughout the aging process. Remember, consent, respect, and personal agency are paramount in all sexual relationships, regardless of age. Thank you for joining us today as we explored the topic of age and sexual intimacy. Remember, sexual wellness is a personal journey that evolves throughout life. By prioritizing open communication, maintaining physical health, and embracing personal preferences, we can continue to foster fulfilling and satisfying sexual relationships at any age. If you found this video informative, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more thought-provoking content. And as always, we encourage you to share your thoughts and experiences in the comments section below. Until next time, take care and embrace the joy of healthy and consensual sexual connections.